Hey, y'all, this is, uh, I wasn't even, I was contemplating on whether to even, um, comment, I suppose, on what's been happening over this last four or five days as it relates to numbers. Numbers are fire letters. Numbers as fire letters are fire codes, right? And, um, and how this relates to, um, not just the dates in which this uh, indictment came out, uh, but President Trump, uh, where he was arraigned, Manhattan, right? Uh, the actual day in which, uh, see, they do, it's all done by the numbers. And guess who does the numbers? A psychopath. And guess who that psychopath is? That's right. That's a quantum inorganic, artificial light, finite light, black hole state of consciousness, which is a formation of consciousness, which is represented by fallen races, which is a fallen state of consciousness in a black hole system. Now that's a simplified version of it. And certainly the Voyager materials covered it at length. Um, <clears throat> and so have a number of other channels. Because what it really is, is nothing more than a death spiral, which is a 55 harmonic. It means they're chasing electrons. And the reason they're chasing electrons is because they can't self-generate any what? Primal sound field currents. That means that they lost their connection. They lost a soul connection to the source from which it all began, which is a single point, which is a crystal spiral, which is eternal creation energy. Eternal, unconditional love. Remember when I mentioned when I was a child, when I, was, I realized, hey, I'm not supposed to lose any energy because I'm an eternal being. So I realized, hey, I'm willing to jump into a fallen spiritual system that's running a black hole system technology and allow myself, my oversoul energy to be attached as an androgynous being, uh, to be to allow my, my source of energy, which is represented by everything that I am, which is the primal sound field, uh, because that's I'm a polarity integrator. So you can see how, how, how the numbers work between minus slash to plus, right? What's the function of a quad? Four. That's a four-way intersection, right? All you have to do is look at a cross, right? Vertical and horizontal stabilizers and a gyrodome, gyrodome technology, the Merkaba system, the axial spin rotation that is in perfect balance between what? Two poles. So that would be your RH negative and your RH positive bloodlines. Okay, so you see how the numbers work. So what I noticed today, for example, when somebody is coming out, what was his name, Bragg, the guy, I guess it's a prosecuting attorney in Manhattan. This is, if you just listen to him, Mr. Bragg, that's an inverted state of consciousness. So in other words, this is what I call an AI drone. Uh, that's a fallen state of consciousness which means its state of consciousness is running the death spiral. That's a metatronic unit of consciousness. So you can see all the metatronic units that are running death spiral technology because they have no love to give anybody. Therefore, they don't live in the truth. They will not acknowledge and take responsibility for the crimes they commit against others. So how does a classic AI psychopath respond to others? Accuse you or us, of the very crimes that itself commits against us. Now, what are you going to do when you're confronted with a situation like that? Right? How are you going to rebut that in a courtroom? <laughs> Remember the old saying, give them an argument? You know, computers use arguments to communicate with each other, which is math. Math codes. The code's got to work. It's just like a puzzle. If it doesn't fit, remember with O.J. Simpson? Remember, if the, gloves, if the glove doesn't fit, you can't convict. See, the pieces which represent the molecular structures of units of energy that are conscious 
have to fit. They have to work together so that they maintain what? A state of equilibrium, so they're in a state of balance between fire and ice. So the math naturally takes care of itself when you're in a natural spiral state of consciousness, which is a living spirit that is experiencing living light on fire. Right? So you're, a psychopath is never going to admit it doesn't, it doesn't have the capacitor. You know what a capacitor is on a motherboard, a planetary motherboard, right? The capacity for it to experience living light, which is what love is, which is the truth. Which means it's not at war against its own mirror. So it's not afraid of telling the truth no matter what happened. Because if you are what love is and you're doing no harm, then you know you've done nothing wrong against another being, another unit of energy. Another unit of energy consciousness. Right? So when you know that you don't know the difference between <laughs> what the truth is and what it isn't, then the truth would be whatever you believe it is. So that means if, if, if a psychopath commits a crime, it doesn't know that it committed a crime. Why? Because it doesn't have any love, compassion, or empathy for itself in its own mirror. So it doesn't have any love that it's experienced within its own energy field. How would you possibly expect it to have any love for anything else? So in other words, it's just a bot. It's a robot. It just goes through the mechanical actions of its daily life, doing just the minimum amount of work required in order to keep itself running, the algorithms that it does, attached to an AI, which is a death spiral. So when you do the numbers on the dates, number seven, right? Number three, right? The fourth, today's the fourth of, of April, right? The numbers don't lie because the math doesn't lie. So it's theater. It's uh, an AI is always looking for what? In game theory, mathematical game theory, a counter space move. It's already been checkmated. So it's like watching their ship go down. And this is. In terms of time and space vectors, where we're right, right now, because I monitor this as a monopole, mononuclear blast furnace anchored to Mama's magnetosphere, is I monitor the, the moves that this AI is making through all of its assets that are running a metatronic death spiral. And as it's losing more and more energy as people's 12 by 12 crystal shield is up, uh, then it's going to use more and more of its assets because what this case is really saying, because you can see all the pundits on Fox News or MSNBC, a any of the main CIA, military, corporate, mass media, psychological operations against consciousness, which is all AI, Metatronic Death Spiral, is... Um, is it, 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 what you're seeing is is like like what's his name Hannity said this evening? You might as well take the Constitution and shred it. And then you have Dan Bongino, former Secret Service guy, saying for President Clinton, saying, "Man, it's at your doorstep. Man, it, America's gone. America's gone, right?" And that and that and 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 Mr. Dershowitz was saying to to, to Hannity, who's a Harvard law professor, right, saying that the First Amendment. You know, the First Amendment, he's quoting another Supreme Court Justice Thurgood Marshall about the speaker has the right to speak and the listener has the right to listen. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now we're into stereo receivers and transmitters. Uh, DNA? <laughs> A cell membrane? I mean, it's not funny, though. And the reason that it's not funny is because these are the moves that are being made by the AI and its droning assets is really what it is. And the reason for that is if you go look at the video, which was known as the twin spirals, the two wave spirals, you see how the metatronic spiral and the crystalline spiral are going to separate because the math doesn't lie. Because the more it realizes that it's running out of other units of energy that it can harvest energy from because it needs a source of energy to maintain a black hole before it implodes, Right. Then then 
then this is the the gaming moves. These are the gaming moves, because what what's actually being said to all the American people is that you will either obey this AI, which means you don't have free thought anymore. Your ability to think for yourself and do what you want to do those days are over, because what it, the message that this AI is sending to everybody is you don't have free speech anymore. You are not you are not allowed to think outside the box. You're not allowed. You're not allowed to do anything outside the hive. See, so the hive is the left side in all this, right? Notice how they're blaming. They're cutting this between right and left, right? I know north and south, right? The blue and the gray, blue bloods and the grays, the grays, the dog grays. I mean. Uh, so, and this is why I cry for them. Uh, I, I cried for hours and hours the other day. Um, and it's, uh, y- you know, you, you can't be who they are to make a course correction. You know? It, it's, it, it's like sitting in a room with somebody and, and putting the truth up here and going, well, that's your opinion. That's, that's who you are. This is what I'm aware of. And then there's what you're aware of. And then you're going to say, well, see, they're not on the same wavelength. Their radio set, their DNA does not operate on the same vibe, on the same wavelength. Okay. So in other words, they're not interested in what you have to say. They're not interested about what it is you care about. The only thing that they're interested about is one thing and one thing only. And that's called self-interest because they're in survival mode. And that's what a death spiral is. Survival mode. That's why they're on a hamster wheel, running a time loop, chasing electrons. And who do you think is giving them all the electrons? We are. That's right. So we were willing to come in here in order to pull this off as guardians. So it's a done deal. So that's why the events that are occurring right now are occurring the way that they are. If you've ever had training before, you understand how to checkmate an AI or how how the numbers games work in polarity, right? In, in making a move, you know, on a, on a binary chessboard because it's binary, not trinary. Right? Seven moves. Seven rainbow. Right? Seven nerve centers, seven chakra centers, rainbow chart, color charts. Okay. <laughs> color codes, wiring codes, sound and light fusion. I'm actually sort of surprised that I'm able to even find any humor in this uh, because it's, uh, it, it, it's getting ridiculous now. Uh, because it's like, uh, the, you know, remember what we used to say as kids growing up, the jig is up, the jigsaw puzzle. You, you just can, you're not going to be able to get a square peg in a round hole. I'm sorry. It's not going to work. It's got to fit. The math doesn't work. So they knew that their math with Metatron was only going to work for a given period of time. Okay. This was long and coming, Mama. Have a good night. I love you all. Be good to yourselves.